Hi, Ian Austin with TheProblems.com here. We are down at Victory Square in the downtown east side where binners have a new source of revenue today. Five cents is being handed out for every coffee cup collected in the downtown east side. The streets are cleaner. A few people have gained some new wealth this morning. Not a huge amount, $20 per 400 cups. And they're happy about it. It's a slow day today. I'm cashing these all in. Uh, I spent about two hours all told. I wound up with like 600 cups. So, pretty easy work. Like I had nothing else to do but watch TV anyway, so I may as well make money. And the Binners Project hopes one day that every time you buy a coffee cup, a nickel will keep them out of the landfill. One of the biggest sources of waste paper in the landfill is coffee cups and they believe that that can be diverted by using a refundable five cent system. So today we're very happy, we positively surprised, I was really surprised. Um, officially the, the coffee cup revolution was starting at 9.30 but from 8 o'clock we already had a lineup. Beaners being here, happy to be here, very lots of, lots of energy, it's, it's really nice actually. And they came with like shopping carts, bags full of coffee cups. Um, so they've been lining up, they've been patient and very nice. And they all, like everybody, when they have 400 cups, they get $20. So they, I guess they, that makes them happy. And also we're trying to add like a creative part maybe. So people are doing a sculpture, like some sculptures with coffee cups. We're trying to draw attention so that People who use coffee cup, they cannot stop and have a look at it. I'm studying industrial design at Emily Carr, and uh, I'm not sure how it fits in, but I, I definitely look into social issues in my program, and uh, and sol solving problems is a lot of what we do, So, and working with materials, so um, I think all of that kind of relates to this. We're asked to do sort of something about um, the social issues or community issues, so my plan is, I don't know how far I'll get, but um, is to kind of make a community uh, like a sort of structure that people could kind of gather around. For theprovince.com, this is Ian Austin.